Then the surgeon will use a gloved hand to conduct a vaginal examination and will check the size and location of the uterus by pressing on your lower abdomen. A metal or plastic vaginal speculum is used to gently expand the vagina and allow access to the cervix. Once the cervix is visible, a forcep is used to grasp the front lip of the cervix, causing the uterus to open a little. Using a blunt-tipped probe, the surgeon carefully measures the length of the uterus and takes a small sample of tissue from the cervical canal. Next, the surgeon will dilate, or open, the cervix, using a series of progressively larger metal rods called dilators. When the cervix has expanded sufficiently, the doctor will use a spoon-shaped instrument called a curette to gently scrape out the lining of the uterus. In some cases, surgeons use a vacuum curette that sucks tissue out through a narrow tube. When the entire lining of the uterus has been removed, the instruments are withdrawn. The tissue removed will then be sent to a laboratory for analysis.